Good evening, YouTube friends and family. This is your girl, Laura, coming to you with another video. And today we're going to talk about loyalty. Loyalty versus disloyalty. Now, you hear a lot of talk about loyalty. It's all in the media. Uh, you hear that being talked about in the government, amongst family, amongst friends, in marriages. There's a lot of talk about loyalty. Well, let me ask you something. Have you ever been in a relationship in which 100% loyalty was expected of you? You were expected to follow this person blindly without question. Have you ever experienced that? You're expected to follow this person blindly. Everything that they want to do, you're expected to jump on board with enthusiasm blindly, without question. And if you did have any questions, what reaction did you receive by asking a question? Were your questions ignored? Did this person consider you questioning them disrespectful? Did they consider you disloyal because you had questions? Were your questions met with anger? Or did they make you feel bad for having a thought of your own? Did they make you feel bad because you refused to go along blindly? Well, my friend, how did that make you feel? I'm quite sure that you felt inferior, powerless, insecure. It made you feel insignificant. It caused you a bit of worry and frustration. You probably even felt stressed and overwhelmed. Well, what is loyalty? The definition of loyalty is a feeling of support or allegiance to a person or a thing. Total faithfulness a pledge of duty, fidelity, and obligation. To stand by a person or a thing in good times or bad. To be dedicated. To treat this person or thing as a priority. For example, loyalty is expected in friendship, family, loyalty to country, and in a relationship. You know, whether you're dating or especially in a marriage, loyalty is expected. Now, let me ask you this about this person who expected you to follow them blindly, without question. Did this person reciprocate loyalty back to you? Did this person reciprocate it in a way back to you as the same way they expected it out of you? If not, my friend, just know this. Loyalty is not a one-sided deal. It is your right to not go along with something or a situation in which the obvious outcome is going to be bad or it's going to place you in danger. If you're in a relationship with someone who questions your loyalty because you have a question or you will not follow them blindly, my friend, you are in a relationship with a manipulator. This person is playing a head game with you. And it's all about control and power. Let me advise you of this, my friend. Before you follow anyone blindly into a situation, here are a few questions that you should be asking. First of all, who is this person? Do they demonstrate integrity, character, and honor? Do they reciprocate loyalty back to you? Anyone who doesn't like questions Remember, my friend, it's always been said that they probably have something to hide. So, if you're expected to follow blindly without question, what is this person hiding? Have they demonstrated that they have your best interests at heart? Or, when things go wrong, do they expect you to bail them out without question? My friend, you have a right to stand up and to refuse to go along with anything that you don't want to go along with. That is your right as a person. You should not be expected by anyone to follow them blindly without question. You have a right to question anything. So check your relationship. Is it really loyalty 
versus disloyalty or is it manipulation? Well, my friend, I thank you for listening. If you enjoy the content of my YouTube channel, please like, subscribe, leave a comment or share. And as always, until we meet again, bye-bye, my friends.